One, two, three. Are you ready? Welcome to Do Science with Dom, and I'm Dominique, and today we're going to learn about acids and bases using our red cabbage indicator. Let's go! Before we begin with today's experiment, let's make sure we have all our materials on hand. Today, we will be using red cabbage, laundry detergent, cola, vinegar, pickle juice, and orange juice. We will also use an eyedropper and beaker, but you can use whatever is available at home. All right, now that we have all our supplies, it's time to begin with our experiment. The first step is for you to shred or rip your red cabbage into fine pieces like so. Once done, place your red cabbage inside a pot of water and cover. Boil this pot of cabbage for about 15 minutes or until you can see that the pigment or the color from the cabbage is now inside the water, like so. Now that we have our red cabbage indicator, it's time to grab our household items. I am going to fill our dropper with our household items and place them inside our red cabbage indicator to test to see if it is an acid or base. Okay, now we can begin with our experiment and test our household items. First, I'm gonna take our eyedropper and fill it with our laundry detergent. After it's fill our eyedropper, I'm gonna place it inside our cabbage indicator. Once inside, you can stir it up and see the color change. It is now more of a blue than purple. Next, let's test the pickle juice. We're gonna fill our eyedropper with pickle juice and place it in my red cabbage indicator. If you don't notice the color change, you could try adding more of the substance. Now it was a more lighter color than the previous dark purple. Next, I will be testing the milk. Fill my eyedropper, place it in the red cabbage indicator. Can you see the color changing? All right, next I'm going to try cola. I wonder what color it will change to this time. Have you started to notice a pattern at home? If so, write it down or discuss it with your parent or friend.
right now that we have completed the testing we now have results all right now that we added our household items inside our red cabbage indicator you should have noticed that the color has changed i'm going to explain to you why this has happened see red cabbage have natural dyes which give it its colors and the substance called anthocyanins is a substance that changes the colors of almost all bright colored fruit plants. The color depends on the acidity of the environment. And by adding household items into our red cabbage indicator, we are changing the acidity and the color of the cabbage. Okay, so what our cabbage is indicating is the acid and base level of our household items. The color acts as a pH scale. A pH scale ranges from 0 to 14. 0 being a high acid and 14 being a high base. In the middle, you will have 7, which is a neutral. If you were to look at our color changes, we can now determine the range of the pH. If you were to look at this one, it is a more of a blue color, which will let us know that this is higher base. If you were to look at this substance, you will see it is a pinkish red color, which now let us know that it's higher in acid. If you take a look at this substance, it is more of a purplish blue color, which will let us know that this is higher in base. This substance did not change much color from the original purplish red, which will let us know that this is closer to a base. This one is closer to our original color as well, but it's more purple and pink which will let us know that it is higher in acid. And that brings us to the end of our experiment. I want you to take your cabbage indicator and test more things at home that we haven't tried here today. Hope you all have fun. That brings us to the end of Do Science with Dom. Before I let you go, I would like to remind you about the Summer Reading Challenge. You can register online at slpl.org or stop into your local St. Louis Public Library. See you all soon.